Hello, my single solitary viewer. Fluesmaker here, and I'm back on Vintage Craft. Vintage Beef's patron SMP, and I've got a quick little episode here, of course. It mainly features the Diggs. The Diggs, who has helped me quite a lot with finishing up the Mermaid. Of course, the Mermaid was initially built with a lot of help from the Fuzzy Mole, who, despite not being on the server, actually provided me with basically a 3D model of a mermaid that I was able to basically rebuild in Minecraft once it eventually loads up way over there. <laughs> I guess it won't. It should be noted that the Fuzzy Mole has reached, I think two days ago, 1,000 subscribers on YouTube. So congratulations to him. It's well deserved. Uh, maybe you can look at uh, the link down below and see if you can be 1001. Maybe maybe the 1001 has has already subscribed, but <laughs> maybe you can <laughs> you can uh, be there. I stream with uh, with uh, the Fuzzy Mole regularly, so you might want to uh, have that content in your subscription feed as well. But, um, of course, that model needed a lot of uh, detail work, and that's where Mandy came in the digs and uh, that's what uh, we're focusing the episode on today i'm here with uh world famous the digs that you may know as uh, mandy the frontman singer of mandy and the diglets who uh you know from great international hits like uh, diggy diggy hole uh but of course right now this is, she's not going to be singing for us she's going to be helping me with the mermaid uh, the mermaid has several problems right now uh, that are not looking super fantastic. She looks good from afar, but once you get close, it starts getting a little bit weird. Now, notably, uh, her, 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 her breasticle area uh, might need a little bit of work. Uh, her face area needs a little work. Her arm over there needs work. Uh, perhaps her stomach as well. Uh, like, is some lighting glitches go away? Lighting glitch. Okay, thank you. And, um, oh, there's still lighting glitches left. Anyway, um, and her, her hair and, uh, and stuff uh, like that. Um, so we're going to be probably, go we're going to have to build scaffolds and uh, do a lot of little detail work uh, here today. You think, you think we can do that? Oh, yeah. I'm, I am ready with, oh, I guess all the tools I need. How about um, you? I, I have some tools, <laughs> uh, but we can we can go get more if we need more. That's uh, that's always that's the trick. That's how it is. All right. So first, I think what we we might need is uh, what we call scaffolds. Now, I threw down ladders. Oh, hello, zombie. He's a he's a friend. Don't worry about it. Oh, he made it all the way up to the boom, huh? Oh yeah, he's a, that's, clearly that zombie was a male, because he was really heading straight for it. <laughs> <laughs> one track mind, that zombie, one track mind. All right, of course, when we're, we're doing the, uh, the, the, the boobage area, we're, we're not trying to make anything lewd, we're just, uh, you know, the way, uh, the, uh, the great sculptors of history did Vinus de Milo. And so on, and so many others. Except th this one has arms. You know. <laughs> yes, yes. But I'm um, just making some uh, scaffolds for now that we can use to do some uh, work. And we're taking bets to see how many times I can die. <laughs> well, you'll 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 discover that with uh, feather falling boots. It's a lot more difficult to die on the regular. That's true. I'm sure That's you can true. still pull it off. <laughs> oh, yes. I because you, you don't lack for determination in this area, but um, let me try over here to figure out where the hair is. I'm going to have to redo the hand over here. It looks like she has a hand here. I think... So are you are you standing on her hand? I'm right below you. Yeah, I think I think this is not supposed to be a hand. This I think this is to be a, a I think it's supposed to be a curl of hair. Oh, okay. I think. Are you going to make a different? I so think I asked I, you that already. You are so going to make a different I, color. Yeah. So if I try to make the hair a different color, 
And I'm, I, I try to make it a little curlier than, than this. Oh, I should have been using the uh, Silk Touch pick. Dang it. Okay. Um, so let me, let me see here. We try to make this just a little curlier. And we make this look more like hair. What happens is, okay. like, the boobs are roughly at the same height right now, but normally, if you ever seen uh, uh, women do this, if a, a person raises their arm, uh, the pectoral muscles pull on... Well, you know, the, the, the pectoral muscles pull on your, your softer tissue, and uh, <laughs> they, they, it, it, it raises stuff. <laughs> And that's what uh, we all do in the mirror to make it look like if we had a boob job. Yeah. Or, a little yeah, secret right, for you. <laughs> yeah, little tips, <laughs> pro tips. <laughs> <laughs> or when you're doing a shampoo commercial, you know. Yes. Which, uh, you know, every woman does all the time, shampoo commercials. Yes, every single time during the shower. <laughs> so this one part of her boob isn't centered do you want me to center it because i'm uh, gonna lower it and see how yeah, it looks well, make make it look uh, yeah may, may, you know okay you're you're the plastic surgeon okay all your right, patient all right. is uh, is this mermaid and she came she comes in and she's like i don't know what's wrong with my boobs <laughs> right one's up one's down well, i'm one paying you the big one bucks. looks right <laughs> i'm paying you the yes, big exactly. bucks to make me look like a movie star All right, let me let me look with a little fly. Oh, oh no. Okay, there you go. Sometimes I, I, I have might, a bit of a failure to launch. I might have to give her a bit of a nipple, just as a visual for myself. Yeah, yeah, no, just as a visual cue. We'll we'll try it with and without and, and stuff. You want me to play? You want to place a stone button? No, no, that'd be too small actually. But. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone would call her micro nipple, and she'd be no. Yeah. <laughs> Don't make fun of my Get micro nipples. Itty bitty something. Actually, looks good from down here. The 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 breasticles. Well, no, 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 yours. Oh, the the arm. Okay, okay. Yeah, the arm looks a little bit more like an arm. You might have to take a little off the bottom of her uh, elbow. bicep. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, elbow yeah, kind of under. Yeah. yeah. So what what part of the arm was uh, too thick? The underside. Yeah, I'm, I'm at the underside. The underside but I, of the, I have a, I have a little bit of, of the top. Where where the elbow is? Yeah, but a little lower. Like I'm wondering. It doesn't looks okay to me, but I don't know. Maybe am I am I? It looks a little rounded off. Maybe maybe it's the elbow needs to be a little pointier. Yeah. Take. Take, see how like the very end of the elbow you have three, I think, mm -hmm. three blocks high? Right, yeah. Take off take off one each of that very end. So it's more of a point. See what I'm saying? Nope. Take off uh, not to shoot you. Oh, why? Hold on a second. More like 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 this. Oh, but but put it put it um. Put one back. One back. Which one? This one. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Now let me let me back up.
feels like uh, it needs to be from here. This. And uh, right now, the uh, it's funny because the uh, <laughs> the scaffold you made to to back up and take a look look right. like giant elongated nipples from this uh, <laughs> <laughs> from this angle. <laughs> Machine gun jubblies. Yeah, 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 right, right, right. They're, uh, uh, from, what were they called? Uh, the fembots yeah. from Austin Powers. Yeah, yeah, yeah from Austin Powers. Yes. <laughs> oh, this has been quite the entertaining afternoon. Let me tell you. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> okay. Well, let's see here. So, is her nose going to be in line with basically her chest bone? I, I don't even know. I'm not even sure oh, where okay. her head okay. is okay. facing. If you know. <laughs> if I know. Okay. If you know That's where her face is, like if you look at her and you kind of, you start seeing the vision of, oh, I, now I see her face. All right. Now I know what she's doing. Okay. Uh, go ahead. Okay. Like okay. If, if it's only placing two blocks to, to, to say these are going to be her, her eye holes. Because <laughs> okay. she doesn't even have <laughs> okay. eye sockets or anything. Right. I'll make sure they're extra creepy. <laughs> no, I mind the block. I mind the block right underneath your feet. Oh, I see. One single block makes a very awkward nipple. <laughs> yeah. You think it should be uh be four blocks? <laughs> well, I don't know if I have room. That, that's why I don't think in the end I don't think there should be uh yeah, like no, an I actual don't think nipple. So either. Um in the in the final after once the final countdown is done. I'm sabotaging your work right now by having her that's hair fine. fall next to her boob. No, that's that's fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna lie down and uh, try and see if I can see. <sighs> it's it's a it's a difficult job. It's a difficult job. Yeah. See, it's uh, yeah. see, Minecraft is all like very blocky blocks, so trying to make things look really organic is actually quite the challenge. And of course, uh, you or curvy, curvy and organic, and right, you know, yes, women curvy. tend to be slightly curvy. I don't know if you've noticed this about uh, and about women. For sure, organic. Well, I guess not always organic. Sometimes they're fake. They can be, yes. Uh, but it, it, even if we, uh, if we, if our mermaid ends up looking like she has bolted on tits, it's still gonna. <laughs> it's still okay. <laughs> that's that's fine. That's fine. I'll take well, it. They really do with the uh, with the scaffolding. Okay, I think if I. Uh... I'm going to have to go buy a lot of clay from Sten. Yeah. Very, very sad. Makes me sad that I'm basically the person that gives him all his diamonds. They're all from me.
I think she no. I, yeah, like look look down here. Look down here at the water. I'm in a boat. I, I don't know. Yeah, I see you. Yeah. If I think her face should probably be on that flat area there. The one below me here. Uh huh. Uh huh. And because then she's looking out, like towards the. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess towards your hill and pirate ship and all. Uh, well, I was just curious how long uh, you've had a channel, a YouTube channel. I, I think I think I uh, opened it in 2014, but at first it, I only put oh, okay. music on there, so okay, it wasn't uh, you know there wasn't uh, any uh, videos or many videos to speak of. There was only uh, mainly only uh, music. What kind of music? Well, I, I think most people agree the crappy kind. Uh. Crappy kind, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, self, self deprecation is always the is my go to. Uh, okay. okay, you can you can brag about your music. I don't mind. Well, I mean, I've, I, I make the I make the music that I like. Oh, it's I, music I, you I, make. Yeah, of course, yeah. Like the. Oh, I just thought you were like. You've heard the Vintage oh. Craft uh, intro, perhaps? Uh, yeah, the, yeah, of uh, course. Yeah, intro. Yes. yeah, yeah. The, so that's oh, the yeah. example of uh, music I make. <laughs> oh, no, that's super cool. Okay. And that's, uh, that's how the, the channel started. And then uh, after discovering the existence of Minecraft, actually, no, that's not true, because for, for many years I had completely dismissed Minecraft as a game that uh, was just for kids, you know. Right, right. Because uh, as, uh, as we know, like if there's uh, realistic uh, graphics and so on, that's a game for, for, uh, for grown-ups. Yes, for grown-ups, if, uh, for men. If the, yeah, if the graphics are cartoony <laughs> or blocky or whatever, that's for kids. That's for tiny little and, children. And ladies. <laughs> yeah, for example, <laughs> yes. Um, so the like I had pretty much entirely dismissed Minecraft out of hand, and never given it any okay. kind of chance whatsoever because you know you just it's for kids, right? Not, right. not just kids, but tiny little, <laughs> right? Little kids, little, kids yes, of the yes. tiny little variety. Well, see, I'm a big weenie, so I don't like to play anything that's scary. So this well, is Minecraft like... is basically one of the scariest games you could find. Oh, no, 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 no. Like, like uh, my brother used to play... Um, surprise Creepers uh, are, like, terrifying. Well, yeah, that's true. That's true. But no, my brother used to play Resident Evil and all that. Right. And I would jump and... Hey, you know what? I used to watch my brother play video games all the time. And you know how much it makes me mad that I didn't start recording all that way back then? <laughs> I mean, I could have been a uh, YouTube millionaire right off the bat in the 90s. Yeah, it, it, before it even existed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah no i i often feel like uh, i i never had the compulsion initially to uh, to record anything i did which i, I could have yeah and i i you know i'd probably have uh, more subscribers now because than now but anyways long story short i started recording only because you know i had uh discovered that you can play minecraft even if you're not a tiny little child Right, exactly. Yeah, there's, and there's uh, there might be something written there for you, and a friend of mine, you know, did not believe it, of course. Right. So the, uh, and I, he would not like. Well, here I could link you to this person, per, for example, named Vintage Beef, and may, maybe you can see that. Uh, yeah. Maybe you can see that uh, you know it's not just for tiny little children, and it's in there. Nah, I'm not watching that. 
He's like, all right. Then I made the video, and because it was me, he watched it. <laughs> and, uh, you know, he, he, he still doesn't play Minecraft, but at least he, he under, finally he understands. <laughs> yes, he has an at appreciation least. for it. Yeah. So that was my uh, initial, my first, my very first single solitary viewer. Was an actual single solitary <laughs> viewer. Right. And I, I just, uh, I just kept, watch. yeah, I just kept the, uh, the introduction just because I find it funny. And I, I kind of, every, every, every person who, uh, decides to take time out of their day to watch a video of mine, they're as, as special to me, uh, as like my single solitary viewer. Exactly. Because you, they chose, they chose to take time of their day and, uh, watch Flizmaker. Of all things. Oh, or the digs in this case. Or the digs. I have I, I literally do have one viewer and it's usually me. <laughs>
The, the idea that I initially had, as you know, was uh, to create a loop with her uh, thumb and uh, index finger so that when people look in DINMAP, they would look through the loop and lose the game. But uh, yeah, maybe maybe that's not the best thing to do. Maybe that's not the well, best thing to do. We can take out this terracotta here, really <laughs> emphasize it. Mm -hmm. Um, and I didn't really mess with her arm much because I got a little scared that I was really going to mess everything up. So yeah, the the problem is if we actually move her arm, then that changes the structure, the basic structure, like quite a lot. So yeah. we can't. We can't really afford to to move her arm too much. Uh, what next? What next after the uh, okay. the ribs taking well, off like uh, six essential ribs? Yep, <laughs> only somewhat essential. Yeah, so long as the spine she... is is still intact, I think she she would be able <laughs> to stay up. She can still breathe. Okay, but the most important thing I came over here were for her boobs. Um. Yes. What, yes. what what we might call uh, in uh, the scientific community the breasticles. The breasticles, her chesticle breasticles. Mm -hmm. So, yes. so I lowered, I moved the right bosom to the left a little bit, and mm -hmm. I lowered it down a block at least, and gave it a little bit more gravity. Gravity, she was yes. quite, yeah, yeah, she was quite pointy. Um, was she, she was pretty pointy. Well, not, yeah, she's still pretty pointy. There's still, I mean, it's, it's still, I mean, it's a present in here. Yeah, yeah right. Oh, no, we, we oh, I just noticed we forgot one, <laughs> one piece of cobble. Oh no! She, okay, she has wait. a she has a tumor. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a tumor. It's not a tumor. <laughs> now listen. Oh, if you're not old enough to know <laughs> kindergarten cop, well, you know, yeah. good for you. <laughs> Who is your daddy, and what does he do? <laughs> okay. Now that she is tumor free, that's why you know. Make sure you okay. check for lumps and breast cancer and so on. Right? Yes, this is a very thing. yes. It's a PSA. Exactly. The more you know. Um, okay, so yeah, so right boob. I think it's looking pretty good. I was actually pretty impressed when I came back and got back to your pirate cove. I was like, hey, she looks pretty good. Yeah, this works. It's, yeah. Uh, it looks, yeah, I mean, she, 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 she looks, um, she looks, she doesn't look like many years of uh, gravity ha have been at work. Uh, no, she but, certainly uh, hasn't had children. Well, Oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm, I'm not exactly sure how mermaids have children, to be frank. <laughs> <laughs> Magic. Yeah. Well, I'm boys not, and girls. It, I suppose it's, it, <laughs> they lay eggs somewhere, and then the, the males come around and fertilize the eggs that have been laid. It's really not romantic uh, at all. But where, but where do the eggs come from? Where do they leave? Well, on fish, there would be a slit somewhere. <laughs> Yeah, right, right. Uh, uh maybe cloaca? maybe this, like, this cloaca is it. of some sort. Yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> maybe it's maybe that's what I'm standing on, for all I know. Uh. Oh yeah, could be. Watch <laughs> out. Um, okay, so how about the uh left boob? Uh, her we didn't, left I didn't or my do left? It. Uh, her left, her left. Okay, sorry, um, right. So I, 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 if I remember right now, I, I lowered a couple off the top. Yes. And then I'm not sure I moved it center at all, but I, I was playing with the, the breastbone there yeah. quite a bit. I, I do remember we created more space between them, actually. Where, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. And we had to kind of go back and forth. That was definitely the nip and tuck because we kept yeah. putting stuff in and out. But yeah. It's, oh, it's very and difficult then, to make blocks look look like organic. <laughs> look smooth and round. Mm -hmm. And I did give her a little bit of a tummy tuck. Yes. So she's got more of that. What is this? A four pack here? She's got kind of a four pack going on. Instead of a six pack. Yeah, she's 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 in shape. Yes. Give her a little more definition as it goes down to the center there. So. So yeah, that was. Oh, and I think. 
Well, I did, I did, I didn't work on the arm, but I did point out a few things on yes. her arm. Yeah, yeah, you, little, you, you did, you did help. As I sculpted out the arm a little bit better, uh, we, it, it was, you know, it was very not good looking, the arm, let's just say. Yeah. <laughs> it did not look good. Right. Uh, maybe she, her, her elbow should still be a little more pointy. Uh, there's kind of a lack of pointy elbow there going, but it, maybe on the top we're there. close. Yeah, we're really close. Now it's actually now that I pointed it out, it's bothering me, and I need to go up there and add okay. a couple blocks. <laughs> so eh, live building, yes. live action. Okay. okay, uh, but oh no no, I probably have more. <laughs> I came up here and I didn't have any smooth stone, but I do have oh, just a ton. Sorry. Okay, I have forty eight blocks. Okay, so if we're saying we want a point here, elbow. Definitely. Yep. Oh, that looks actually. That looks good from here. Oh, really? Oh, ju only that? I, I think... Just that one? Yeah. Yeah, for I, sure. I, I think I should probably do it like this, and that's going to look pointy, like that. Would that would that look good? It looks pretty good from down here. All right. Well, let, let's go with that for now. Let's go with that for now. Now, while I'm up here, you can notice that she uh, now has a uh, uh, clay for head. And that's really her hair, and we decided to try and um, make it more visible where she'd be looking. And now she's looking straight in front. From the from the first struck, from the first version, I think her head was kind of tilted and uh, looking diagonally, and it was it was weird a little bit. And now I made her face towards the front so that her her face is simpler. She has no facial features per se. You'll notice this, uh, I, I assume, and that's because, if you remember, we tried uh, making <laughs> eye holes and stuff, and it was, it was uh, to say it was creepy, was uh, the <laughs> <laughs> was putting it mildly. It was a uh, nightmare fuel. So now, like she okay. has the the kind of face that you can finish in your imagination's eye instead of like just being complete nightmare fuel. This is also a really great view of uh, of the mermaid as a whole from the from the ship. But now she has clear hair. She has uh yeah. Uh, now no, I I think it actually looks pretty good. It looks pretty good, Mandy. We, we done I did think a good it job. Does. Yeah, I really oh. actually I really like her hair. I like her bang. I added a tiny little fishing boat as well. <laughs> now that uh, I know I like. <laughs> we're there. Want... I just decided this bay is a little too empty. I need a third ship. There you go. Do you need me to hide this footage? No, no, no. No, no it's it wasn't an episode. I did that, uh, you know, uh, I often, like, come along while I'm rendering videos or something and do something. So I can't record while I'm rendering stuff. Oh, um, right, of course. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, no, I'm, I'm uh, really happy you helped me with uh, with this, Mandy. Yes, well, happy it this. was fun. I'm glad to do... Uh, some community work here on the server instead of just minding my own business. Is this shooting oh, yeah. me? I didn't shoot at you. As I inspect the work that Extreme Dummy has done on the tunnel so far, uh, I bid you farewell for this episode. I actually recorded more stuff with the digs. Uh, we visited her base, but this episode is already long enough as it is so uh, I'm, I'm ending it here, and we'll visit her base uh, in a later episode. Perhaps uh, we'll join that with uh, another base uh, visit. But uh, yeah, I, th this episode is long enough as it is. I would just want to thank you uh, very, very much for actually watching all the way through and up to this. If um, if you have watched up to this, you can uh, you can write the secret word in the chat. Shiitake. Yeah, some type of mushroom. Can you sense a trend? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Sponsored by the Flues Crew on Patreon.